welcome to part two of Pull the Pork with the Michigan Barbecue Addicts. What we're doing right now is mopping our pork butt. Got the recipe attached. It's pretty darn good. Give it a try. Next, you're going to take your foil pan, slice up a stick of butter, put it at the base of the pan, and then you're going to go ahead and disconnect your meat thermometer and put the pork butt inside the foil pan. Cover it up tightly with foil and then go ahead and place it right back into the smoker. It's not done yet. All right, barbecue addicts, we have just hit hour nine of our pork butt smoke, and we've stalled out at 170 degrees Fahrenheit. This is very normal, and just keep going. Don't change the temperature, just keep moving forward. After 15 hours, this pork butt is done. We don't even need the old hickory for this one. I think it's tender enough. So tender, we can tear it apart with our hands. And of course, I can't resist. This is probably one of the best pork butts I've ever made. Of course, I'm gonna have to use one of my favorite barbecue sauces, Killer Hogs Vinegar Sauce from How to Barbecue Right. And I tell you what, it paired perfectly. When your meat pulls apart with ease like that, you know you've done something right. I've been waiting 15 hours for this moment, the perfect pulled pork sandwich. What should we make next time? Tune in next week and we'll have another barbecue.